this is an exercise about flow rates, and it's using another example of using our calibrated and graduated bottle. Flow rate is a measure of how fast water moves. And in order to do this exercise, you're going to need a stopwatch or uh, a timepiece that can keep uh, seconds and even tenths of seconds if you want to get real accurate about it, or a partner who can watch and keep uh, track of the time. So in order to do a flow rate experiment, this is very simple. We'll start with a bottle with 500 milliliters already in it. And we're just going to pour it out. And you're going to time how long it takes to pour out the bottle of water. Okay, so you start the time when you start pouring and stop it when the bottle's empty. Ready? Go. Stop. Okay, so we have 500 milliliters and it took 3.5 seconds. So we've got a formula here that we can add our 3.5 seconds. So we divide our milliliters by our time to get the flow rate. So 500 milliliters divided by 3.5 seconds well, it gives us 143 milliliters per second. In order to convert this to liters per minute, which is the standard indication of a flow rate, we, have, we can multiply by two conversion factors. One will convert the milliliters to liters, and one will convert seconds to minutes. So one liter is equal to 1,000 milliliters, and 60 seconds is equal to one minute. So if we multiply our milliliters per second, by 60 over 1,000, 1, multiplied by 60, divided by 1,000, gives us a flow rate of 8.6 liters per minute.